Jesus, it's been a while. How are you? Give me a smile. Oh, that is so great. I know you usually give gifts to me, but it is the season. Oh yeah, just like this. Good. Oh wow, that picture, you took a great picture. Oh my goodness, I have to tweet it now. So anyway, it's Thanksgiving. Abraham Lincoln was being persecuted in England, so he came over uh, here on the boat called the, the Mayflower. This is way before Abraham Lincoln freed the slaves. Coincidentally, like you freed my soul. So they jumped out of the woods, and they had this big hat on, and they did a song and dance like this. And they were riding around on sheep because they'd forgotten the horses back in England. Muzzle loader, so they were smashing it in like this. <laughs> A lot of people died that winter. But then Abraham Lincoln said, you know what, we need a holiday. We need people to, you know, be more thankful. They didn't have any food. And they'd never seen a turkey before. <sighs> Basically, that's the story of Thanksgiving. I think now is a good time for me to tell you what I'm thankful for. Orange soda, Atari. I'm trying to think what else. Scarves, capers, carpet, electricity, hats, sandwich bags. And I lock brakes. My church finally does the two four instead of the one and three. That was something that I had brought up last time. Remedied that. I am thankful for the wave at the stadium. If you had an email address, what would it be? I think it would be he lives at heaven. I think that about sums it up. I mean, I should probably get going. My kids are still in the car anyway, so. No, that was, that was fishes and loaves. He doesn't do the same thing with turkey and stuffing. 